Hello there, I am Giant Gold with more Pokemon Yellow. In the last part, we took on the rest of self Kill. We took on Giovanni once again and beat him, of course. We took on Justin James from Team Rock again. We also took on our rival, uh, Sean, again. Beat him, too. And, uh, yeah, now we're, uh, now we're, um, ready to take on the Pokemon Gym of Sab Sabrina's Pokemon Gym, I should say. The sixth gym, of, the sixth gym of Kanto. Okay, Saffron City Pokemon Gym Leader Sabrina. The Master of Psychic Pokemon. Master of the Psychic or something like that. I may have misread that. Okay, yeah, I'll talk to the Rice Giver. Yo, champ in the making. Sabrina's Pokemon, uh, Sabrina's Pokemon use Psychic Power to, instead of Force. Fighting Pokemon are weak against the Psychic Pokemon. They, they get creamed before they can even aim a punch. Interesting, I'll cut some of the statues. Have fun city Pokemon Gym. Leader Sabrina. When you turn to Sean, of course you're gonna be this gym. And there's dogs barking in the background. I do apologize for that, jeez. I have Tabasco for now. Last time I checked. I said, okay, cool. So let's take on the first trainer here. I'm gonna be battling all the trainers in this gym just because of the experience, basically. Sabrina's young, but she's also our leader. You won't reach her easily. Yeah, that's true, because you have to go through the certain pattern of, uh, of, um, panels and stuff. So this is a psychic, apparently. A slowpoke, awesome, nice. Slowpoke's level 33. That's cool, I guess. Let's go for the slash deck, I guess. Probably be our best bet. Oh, I could go in and almost faint it. Jeez, like it's because water got on us, which is going to be super effective. But it doesn't do too much, so that's good. Let's go for another slash. I could have gone for an ember there. I actually just do realize that, but... Oh, well, critical it, nice. Okay, another slowpoke, cool. So maybe we can faint the slowpoke with one slash. That'd be nice. Uh, nope, of course not. Okay, whatever. It's gonna headbutt on us. Okay. Let's go for the ember then to finish it off. Nice. Okay, there we go. Nice. Got it. Got it. Got it. Got it. Yeah. Slow bro is next. Okay. They'll they'll evolve from a slowpoke. Nice. Let's go for a slash attack. These things are very bulky, so that's probably why they're not. Getting one shot, did you know? Buy me Pokemon. Let's go for the slash attack again. Hopefully, we can faint it. Yes, there we go. Nice. So, that was an easy first battle. Not too hard. I lost my concentration. Sorry. Thanks for the 330 Poke Dollars, though. Stage take a random one. Let's take the left one. Oh, look, another trainer. I think this is a sage or something. I don't know. You and I are a uh, Pokemon shell fight. Um, she's one of those types of trainers that I find in like the Pokemon Tower in Lavender Town, but... Oh, it's a Chandler, my bad. It's a Chandler, <laughs> Chandler, or whatever you want to pronounce it. This guess is level 33. Let's try, let's see how much an Ember does, just out of curiosity. I don't, I don't know if I want to use Flamethrower on it, you know. Could have quite nice, okay. Let's get confused, of course. Jeez. Tabasco is confused. I had itself a confusion, of course it did. Hypnosis is the next good thing I didn't hit Tabasco, it didn't affect Tabasco. Nope, of course not, jeez. Hypnosis, jeez. Tabasco, you're making things a lot worse when you don't attack when you're confused. No, I'm just, I can't blame him for that. Let's go for a, um, uh, poke food, I guess, just to wake up a Tabasco. Nice, so the sleeping Pokemon woke up confused, but it felt good. I'm glad it failed. Let's finish it with another ember, hopefully. Confuse no work. Okay, cool. Nice, okay. Okay, there's two more Pokemon. I figure what Pokemon you just sent out. Okay, no. Ghastly. I'm gonna try a flamethrower on this thing, you know? Let's see how much this does. Takes it on one hit. Awesome. Could call it nice. Okay, one more Pokemon. It's a Haunter. Cool. We'll definitely use another flamethrower on this Haunter. This Haunter is level 33. Cool. Let's see how much this does. Just a little, a little bit over half. Okay, fine. We can't use Slash on this because Ghost it's a cat, it's half Ghost type, so we can't use Slash because it's a normal type. Normal type attacks don't work on Ghost Pokemon, Ghost type Pokemon. But yeah, we took it out nice. I lost after all. Sorry, man. Thanks for the engine. I put it also. Stick this trail to help order. He's in the train up here. On their psychic, probably. Uh, do does our unseen power scare you? Nope. Of course not. I'm, I'm not breaking a sweat. It doesn't scare me at all. Guess this is another psychic person. Yeah, Kadabra. Nice. Let's get up his level 31. Let's go for the flamethrower attack. 
There we go, awesome. And it doesn't it doesn't want to KO the that stinks. It's gonna recover on it. It's gonna recover. Let's just do another flame throw on it then. There we go, nice. Tabasco level 47, awesome. Okay, about to slip up. Let's switch to uh, Storm, I guess. Yeah, let's just Storm. Let's get, we're just gonna use a Thunderbolt on this thing. There we go, nice. Nice. Mr. Mime, okay. We'll stay in. Mr. Mr. Mime's also level 31, nice. It's gonna probably go down with a Thunderbolt, hopefully, right? Am I right? Yeah, no, but it was not. Good confusion on us. My confusion did a lot, because it could of course it did. Okay, let's go for the um, Thunderbolt again, just to faint, make sure we faint it. I don't want to use Quick Attack on it and like, maybe, survive, maybe survive in the red health, you know, that'd be bad. Okay, Kadabra, nice, okay. I'm gonna go all, all out with a Thunder attack here. So Storm use Thunder, ha. Ah, there we go, it hits awesome. Nice. So 31, just like his other Pokemon. I right, know the trainers in here are Gen Doris, so I can Gen 1, so they, uh, they're Pokemon. Yeah, okay, let's go for the like, quick attack, hopefully it'll faint it. And it does, nice. I do feel sick. Okay, cool, 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 cool. I never saw this. I'm sorry, man. Thanks for the 310 Poké Dollars. Okay, so let's switch to Basco and Storm, I guess. Okay, so yeah, Boot Roots 40, level 47. Yeah, okay. And then uh, Gamma is 2, Lavender is now, and then Tabasco is. So the only Pokemon, two Pokemon that are on level 47 is Pikachu and uh, Ma uh, Prime Rape. Or in other words, Storm and Grumpy. So yeah, he's another trainer. Let's take him on. Uh, you know that power alone isn't enough. Yeah, in some cases you're right, but sometimes it can work out and be successful, I guess. Okay, Psychic, okay, yeah, another Psychic Trainer, of course. Let's go for the Thunderbolt on this thing, let's go Mr. Mime level 34. Let's see if it faints it. It does, uh, no, it doesn't, of course not. Okay, fine. Let's get Confusion on us. Okay, let's go for the Thunderbolt one more time. It should faint it. There we go, nice, okay. Cool, Storm Grid level 47, awesome. Nice. But just get out. Okay, we'll switch to Grumpy. Even though Grumpy is weak against Psychic type Pokemon, we can still try, I guess. This Kadabra is also level 34, just like the Mr. Mime. Uh, let's go for the Body Slam. Ooh, could go nice. I'll take it. Okay, we defeat Psychic. Awesome. I don't believe this. Sorry, believe it. <laughs> Thanks for the 340 Poké Dollars. I think we already bowed this training, but I'll switch. Uh, Storm and Grumpy, I guess. Yeah, I about you, okay. It's a bunch of trial and error from here, guys. <laughs> I about you. I about you. Let's get downwards, I guess. Oh, we haven't about you yet, yeah. Sabrina is like, younger than I, but I respect her. That's good to know. You're probably another channeler, or channeler. Probably Miss in it. Ha <laughs> Okay, so it's ghastly nice. So body slam and uh body slam. The only the only effective move I think I have is Thunderbolt really. So I can have to use Thunderbolt I guess. Because fighting a normal type Pokemon don't affect this type at all. Uh good thing Thunderbolt does at least over half there. Wick doesn't paralysis cause paralysis, so that's good. Or uh, at least to make you that uh, prime at that time, that's awesome. Good luck for us, I guess. He's gonna send a hunter. Oh they're gonna send a hunter. This Hunter's level 34. Okay, let's get Slenderbolt on this thing. Maybe we can paralyze it, you know? It always has a chance of paralysis, I guess. Let's get Hypnosis on us. Dang it. Well, hopefully it doesn't... Well, if it uses Dream Eater, that's too bad, because the uh, Elf probably used... I used the Pokefoot before. Uh, the Hunter gets the chance to use Dream Eater if it has it, you know? Hypnosis again, but it didn't affect... Uh, grumpy, okay, that's good. Let's give it another thunderbolt. Hopefully, this faints it, but you never know. It could hang on by the skin of its teeth, like I said so many times before in this project. And confuse it, of course, okay. That's okay. I mean, Grumpy stars have a 50 50 chance to be attacking, and there we go. Awesome. Nice odds are with us this time. Yeah, 
to defeat Chen Wei. Cool. Not good enough. Sorry, man. Thanks for 1,020 poker dollars, though. We have another trainer right here. Uh, Pokemon take on the appearance of their trainers. Uh, your Pokemon must be tough then. Thanks, they are tough. They're a hard working bunch of Pokemon, you know? Is this a channel? Okay. Sent out Haunter, cool. Again, I can only use, uh, I can only use Thunderbolt, really. So let's go for the Thunderbolt then. This is Haunter's level 38, jeez. But we're still at 8 levels higher than this, that's awesome. Good, good, nice. Nightshade, let's get a 38 HP. So, uh, I think I'll have like 89 HP, or uh, Grumpy will have 89 HP, yeah, there we go, nice. Simple math right there, baby, ha ha ha. Maybe another critical hit? Oh, that's enough to faint anyway, good. That's good. We defeated Channeler. I knew it. <laughs> Thanks for 1,140 Poké man. I think I bought everyone in this gym except for like two people, one person. One of them being this guy, the psychic, I guess. Saffron's Pokemon Gym is famous for the psychic for its psychics. You want to see Sabrina, I can tell. Yes, of course, but after I battle you and hopefully beat you in a Pokemon battle. Another psychic, yeah. So she has they have one Pokemon, it's a slow bro. Okay, um I have Thunderbolt, so that's gonna be super effective. I'm gonna see how much the Thunderbolt does, just just comparing it with a body slam, hopefully. I'm gonna probably use body slam on it too. Critical at awesome, that's awesome. I'll take it, we'll take it. Yeah, there we go. Grump good level 47, awesome. But if you psychic, awesome. Arg, sorry man. Thanks for the 300 day pocket always though. Oh, we made it to Sabrina. I think there's still one more trainer we may have missed, but uh, I honestly don't want to go back. So, uh, and battle them, honestly. If we made it to Sabrina right here and right now. So, uh, let's heal up our Pokemon first. So, let's see here. Um, Grumpy can use a Super Potion. Storm can use a, a couple of Super Potions. Uh, okay, yeah. I think I know what to do. So, let's see. Super Potions. Let's give one to Grumpy. Let's use another Super Potion on Storm. And another Super Potion on Storm. And yeah, another super potion on, or uh, it's a potion on Tabasco, and I guess a potion. Three, okay. Well, actually, we only have three potions, right? Yeah, so it's just another super potion, on Tabasco. Then I don't think everyone's PP should still be good. Power points, I mean. Jeez. <laughs> okay. Um, let's go for. I'll put Gamma at front, I guess. Because Gamma has Surf. So let's talk to Sabrina. Uh, I, I, I had a vision of your arrival. I have had psychic power since I was a child. I first learned to bend spoon with my, bend spoon. I was, I first learned to bend spoons with my mind. There we go. I dislike fighting, but if you wish, I will show you my powers. Cool. So this is a six gym leader, Sabrina. Nice. She has a whip apparently. Okay. Yeah, awesome. Sabrina wants to fight. Yeah, I want to fight Sabrina. Okay, she has since I had at level 50. I think it I think it knows flash, so it's like a flash setup kind of thing. So keep on using flash on your Pokemon and think that I don't know, maybe that's actually strong good because uh, then it lowers your your Pokemon's accuracy so you can't hit a later Pokemon coming out. So yeah, that's why why flash but it felt good. Let's use another surf. Hopefully the surf will faint it. This app is level 50, jeez. Okay, I think she may have like an Abracadabra and Alkazam. Those are three Pokemon she probably has. Uh, if she does have three Pokemon, I didn't see. Okay, yeah. She has an Abracadabra and Alkazam. It's nice. I think in, uh, Red and Blue, she might have like a Venomoth and a Mr. Mime and whatnot. And um, Alkazam for sure, I know that. But yeah, in Pokemon Yellow, it's different. Uh, let's, let's stay in with the Kadabra, I guess. Get this Kadabra's level 50. Let's see how much the Surf does on this Kadabra. Um, let's see here. It does about half. A good, 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 quite nice. But that's probably gonna heal. Probably gonna help your Pokemon. So I'm gonna get. I'm gonna use this chance to get a Ice Beam on it, just to possibly freeze it. But then again, the Spirit just didn't use a healing item at all. Jeez. Okay. Okay. Alkazam is next. I'm gonna go for an Epic uh, Blastoise sweep if I can. This Alkazam is also level 50. So all three of our Pokemon level 50. That's cool. Let's go for the Ice Beam. I guess. Let's get a Psychic on this. This is gonna hurt. Jeez. Oh well. This Alkazam's gonna be a tough cookie to crack, you know? 
Of course, she gets her own crit crit. Dang it, okay, fine. Let's see, we can send out Tabasco, I guess. I'm gonna use Flamethrower and hopefully burn it, you know, that'd be cool. Flamethrower hits, awesome. Does about one third, it's gives X defend on Alkazam, okay. Okay, fine. Do you raise your defenses? I'm using a special move, right? Because it's for special for my Charizard special stat, I guess you'd say. Fucked, okay. I gained armor, okay. Let's use another flamethrower. Oh man, she's probably gonna heal, honestly. I guess she's gonna use psychic again. Her Alkazam is gonna use psychic again. But it does. Yeah, shoot. Critical at awesome, uh, not awesome for us actually, special fell. So let's use that, let's finish it off with an ember, hopefully. Maybe this will finish it off actually. Critical at nice. Awesome. So it wasn't an epic Blastoise sweep, but it was close, I guess. I only used two Pokemon when she used three. <laughs> I don't know. We defeated Sabrina, nice. Um, I'm shocked, but I lost as a loss. Uh, I admit I didn't work hard enough to win. You earned the Marsh Badge. We got one. Th we got four thousand nine hundred fifty pocket dollars for winning. Awesome. The Marsh Badge makes Pokemon up to level seventy obey you. Stronger Pokemon will become wild. Will become wild, ignoring your orders in battle. That is true. Just don't raise your Pokemon too much. Wait, please take this TM with you. We get TM forty six, which I believe is what is it again? It's Psy Wave. It's the powerful psychic uh, waves. It uses powerful psychic waves to inflict damage. It's pretty cool. My window kind of froze there for a second. So I had to click that. I don't know why it froze there. <sighs> Whatever. Okay. Let's make our way back. Hopefully we can just win. I think if we just go right, 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 we'll eventually make it to the, um, dang it left. Okay, fine. To the, um, uh, uh, hold on. That iTunes popped up or uh, it's wanted me to try and install iTunes or something. I'll be right back. Okay, I'm back. You know, I don't, I don't, ha I don't care for iTunes really, so I don't know. And I, I, I honestly, I honestly downloaded the update just to make it shut up, but then it still pops up every now and then. It's like, what the heck, hey, Sabrina? We made it back to you. <laughs> yeah, so yeah. I'm just trying to make my way to the gym now. Just out of curiosity. Just using random panels, I guess. Hopefully, maybe this is the right one. And then we go to, to the this one, and then we go up, and then we go right. I don't know honestly. I always have to just keep on riding these panels until I find the right path. I could look up the right path to get out. Like I think it's just the reverse order of what it takes to get to Sabrina, the gym waiter that we just defeated. Haha. <laughs> okay, so yeah, I don't. Hopefully, find it sooner or later. You yeah, know that'd be nice. Oh man, I feel like I'm going in circles really. Okay, maybe it's this one right here. And then, oh man, dang it. Okay, was it this one then? Because I know the bottom one was the other way. Although, another way, which we don't really need. Is it this way? No. I'm gonna go back actually. Is it this one right here? Is it downwards? I, I honestly don't know. I just, I always just keep on do, doing the random path until I get here. Get out of to the front of the gym, actually. So it's gonna probably take a while. I might have to cut to where I finally get to it, you know? Okay, I think what I, I think I found out the way to get out of here is just get to this room and go to the bottom right one, and then you're out. Thank you. Okay, cool. I spent like five minutes trying to figure that out, and I actually had to actually look up a video on YouTube how to, like, I just paid attention to whichever, like, what if they go through here this for, at the first panel, I paid attention to what panel that was, and it was the bottom right one right here. So yeah, I had to go to YouTube and figure it out, because I couldn't figure it out, apparently. Anyway, let's talk to the rescue you again. A psychic power, huh? Uh, if I had that, I'd make a bundle at the slots. That's true, actually. <laughs> Is that fun city Pokemon Gym? Waiter Sabrina. Winning trainer Sean Steven. Cool. Awesome. And then uh, the badge looks like this. I'll go to my card, I guess, my training card. Yeah, it looks, um, it looks just like a circle, really, with another circle in it, you know, honestly. It looks kind of funny. It just, I guess it looks cool, I guess, but it's uh, not my favorite looking badge of Kanto, honestly. If it looks like that. Anyway, uh, my name is Steven, of course. M I, we have, uh, 100,000, 130,999, we have one, we have 139, 30, okay, we have 139,939 Pokedollars. Our playtime is 98 hours and 56 minutes. That's pretty cool. We almost 100 hours of playtime. Nice. So I'm going to go back in the Pokemon Center and heal. But I guess I'll do that in the next part. 
uh, in between parts actually. And I, I'll start the next part. Actually, we can actually just fire them and stuff. Why not? Okay. So also, I want to probably put away, um some items here. Uh, just the TM probably like after Sabrina. Yeah. Okay. Cool. Let's fly to uh. Who would want to fly? We're actually going after the real legendary birds next. Is what I'm planning on doing. So, uh, we want to, um, Articuno is first, because Articuno, then Zapdos, then Moltres, is what I'm going to go in. And Moltres isn't found at Mount Ember, because in Red, Blue, and Yellow, there was no Mount Ember. There was no Savvy Islands either. So, and I actually put in Victory Road, actually, so that's where Moltres is. But, we'll obviously get Moltres last, and it's last in the order anyway. So, Articuno is, um, south of, uh, Fuser City, actually, on that route. If, if my memory serves me correct, so let's go back to Fuser City. And we're going to start surfing there. There's also trainers on the water. Just for example, I'll show you guys right here. There's a trainer coming up on the water. So yeah. Right there. Yeah. And we can actually surf now too. Which I'll show off right now. So let's use a surf on our fainted gamma, I guess. We got in gamma. Nice. So yeah. We can surf around and stuff. That's pretty cool. So um. I'll start the next part like right here, but off screen I'll deposit the TM side wave in my PC. And also heal up my Pokemon. And uh. I think all we need for to get to Articuno is really Surf and Strength, really. Because Surf to go across the water and Strength to move boulders around while we're in the Seafoam Islands, which is where Articuno is. One of the Seafoam Islands, at least. Islands Caves, I should say. So yeah, so this has been my Pokemon Yellow Walk through part. Next part, we'll do just that. So this has been Dragon Go again. I would like to mention Goodbye, and I'll teach you guys next part of my Pokemon Yellow Walkthrough Guide. <laughs>